Shopee Mall and it's this. Oh, sorry. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome to episode 7 of Glimpse and this time I have someone new with me. It's our creative head Anish. Hello. So we are here to talk about the top 5 builds from the month of July and uh, there are brands like Western Australia, Belgian Waffle, Lunch Bar, MPL, much more. So we started off the month by working on an Instagram AR filter for government of Western Australia where we had a randomizer and background segmentation. Yeah, that was the more that is the most interesting part to the AR filter because we combine two different features in it. And this AR filter actually features different iconic locations across Western Australia related to geology, wildlife and, you know, different scenic places and ancient uh, sites and all that. So, you know, this gives the users an immersive experience where they could actually transport themselves and see how the place looks to get an idea of what all different things that they can do across Western Australia. So one of my favorite frames in that filter was the outdoor recreation frame where it had an interesting west and uh, lake in the background. Yeah, that is actually a beautiful background. So the next project is a very interesting one that we worked with Samsung. So earlier this year, they had one Super Brand Day sale. And uh, again, this time they came back with another Super Brand Day sale with Shopping Mall. Very interesting project, which is... Yeah. So we worked on the great Samsung scroll where the user had to go through a catalog of Samsung products, which included their home appliances and their mobile sector. And uh, we had actually placed uh, Flip6 Flip six. phones across the scroll. And as the scroll continued, when the users were expecting it to end, that is where there was a surprising element. There was a question which basically challenged the user's memory. The users had to recall how many number of Flip6 yeah. they had seen and answer the correct number to unlock a discount voucher. Also, it was launched in five number of languages across six different countries in Southeast Asia. So Anish, it's been a while since we've worked on some interesting playable ads. Yeah. And after a while, we got a chance to work on two interesting playable ads yeah. for, for MPL. MPL. Yeah. So one of the campaigns for MPL we did was the crash campaign, where basically the user opened a playable ad. They see a rocket that is flying up. Yeah. And before the rocket crashes, you have to check out. So you get maximum rewards. Yeah. And the second one was basically a sneak peek into a Jim Drummy game. It's a very interesting gameplay because Jim Drummy is not like any other card game that you play. It's a little complex because the kind of sets that you need to make from the melds and everything is very interesting. So this playable ad was used as a tool to educate the users on the particular gameplay. And towards the end of the gameplay, there was a download link to the app that they can actually, from where they can download and get some exclusive benefits through this playable ad. Apart from Meta, this playable ad was also promoted on three other platforms such as Unity, Moloko and uh, Liftoff. Next up was the Belgian Waffle Co. where we built a game for their National Waffle Day. And a uh, very interesting thing is that this is the first time they are using gamification as a part of the larger campaign. This is a national level campaign where a lot of people actually queue up outside their stores where they get very interesting deals on this particular day on the year, which is not generally available on all other days. And we basically put a QR code inside the store so that, you know, people who are there in the queues or who are walking in, scan, walking in can actually scan the QR code. Play this interesting game where, you know, there are like two different characters to choose between and the character is just chomping the waffle. So given the illustration style of the campaign, we decided we'll create some interesting micro animations where we add that layer of immersion of visual immersion to the elements that we have. And you just set a high score depending on the score that you reach. You can unlock a voucher code and you can use that in your next purchase. Yeah, so the next interesting campaign we worked on was for Mondelez's Lunch Bar, where the campaign was based on a consp conspiracy theme mm -hmm. where they have a character called Lucas and you have to explore his theories and solve for certain tasks. Okay, this was deployed in South Africa. Yes, so the users land in a desk area, which okay. is Lucas's desk. And they have to basically explore each of the different objects on the desk. By exploring these objects, you tend to go into different experiences. So one of the experiences, for example, a telescope, where you have to find the peanut nebula in a large galaxy. And all this information you will learn from the experience. Another interesting experience is the microscope experience, where you had to find the missing ingredient. 
So there are five ingredients. That is chocolate, wafer, rice cake, caramel, and peanuts. And basically every time the user plays this experience, it's actually different. So it's not like you can replicate the same experience every single time. Another interesting aspect of the task was the radio task where you had to listen to different audios and answer a question based on that specific audio at the end of it. So users had to go through six tasks totally. That's a very interesting elaborate game. In fact, actually the brand took it to schools and universities and you know all the young audience actually loved playing this because of a lot of interesting things that are happening in this game. That's a wrap for this month. So those are top five builds from the month of July. And uh, as usual, like, share and comment. Get in touch with us to build your next big campaign. You can unlock a voucher code and you can use that in your next purchase. We finished the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs>